Lining the upper water line, but first we curl our lashes. You can heat your curler under the hot water tap. Simple and easy. This is done first so that we don't remove any of the gel liner. Simply do it on both sides and make sure that your curler is cleaned afterwards. Next we're going to use the pot gel liner. It's like a gel sitting in a pot with a small detailed brush. I prefer a dome but certainly a flat edged angle. It will work just as well or even an eyeliner brush. Now notice when I'm applying it, I only have a very little bit on the brush and I'm applying it kind of up into the lashes. That's the main thing is to get it up into the lashes and then I go directly in to the tear duct. Get it as far in as possible. My eyes water so I simply use a paper towel because it doesn't have any fibers on it. Set it on the lower lash line and blink and it wipes away any water from my eyes. Oh and be sure to clean your brush every single time with alcohol. Next is the gel pencil and you have to sharpen it every once in a while. And I apply it in the same way. And by the way, when sharpening it, just before you do, put it in the freezer. And just before you apply it, run the hot water over it so it kind of melts the gel just a little bit and you'll get better performance out of it. So you can see I'm doing the same application method as I did with the pot gel. And in this case, I'm coming around and just underneath the outer corner of the lower lash line, I'm applying some too. Wipe those extra tears away, and there we have it. Now for extra longevity, I add a little bit of eyeshadow on another detailed brush and just put it along the gel as demonstrated here. And in this case, I think I'm using the Brune. Just put it on and add a little bit more to the bottom, and there you have it. And now I'm adding some eyeshadow to the lower lash line, putting the most of the deposit in the outer corner and spreading it forward and back. And don't go past the pupil. And this is what really finishes it off. And there you have it. Quite the impact, isn't it? With very little product, and it doesn't look overdone with too much liner. Thanks for watching. See you next time.